Most charity golf events take place on outdoor courses, but the Bethlehem Area Public Library decided to take that same idea indoors this past weekend to raise some money. They erected a mini golf course among the stacks of books at the main branch on Church Street, as Tom Mike Krantz reports. Early season golf in the Lehigh Valley has been an iffy proposition weather-wise. April means all courses are open, but the cold, windy, and or rainy days so far outnumber the good ones. Any alternatives? At the Bethlehem Area Public Library Sunday, not only could you satisfy your appetite for the sport by reading about it, but you could play 18 holes in a rather unique event to support a very worthy cause. Library directors contracted an out-of-state company that actually provides the materials needed to set up an indoor mini golf course, not next to a library, but inside one. I read about this uh, library mini golf company that started up in New England, and they uh, rent out, or you can buy a, a whole miniature golf course and set it up inside your library, have an event to raise money, and we raffle off the holes to different business sponsors and also charge some admission, have raffles, face painting, things like that going on. A modest greens fee and other proceeds went toward the library's Room to Grow project, which also benefits the Southside branch. The Room to Grow project is our desire to move and expand our children's area. The children's area is in the same small room that it was in when the building was built in 1967. We want to move it up to our second floor, which has been storage space and office space. It will be about three times the size. Many of the 18 holes that snake through the library's stacks on the first floor had reading-themed quirks. The course was open from 11 a.m. to 6 p.m. Sunday, and it didn't take long for the course to fill up with Bethlehem area residents, looking for some quality family time while supporting a pillar of the community. I think it was great. They did a great job here at the library. Um, it's an awesome court. Me and my son, my wife, we enjoyed everything about it. Um, it's great, great day, great, great time. How important are libraries in your life? Oh, my son, he's big on reading books and learning, and, and that's a big part of, of our, our thing is to uh, get our children reading and learning. So it is a big part of what we do. It was a lot of fun, definitely some challenges, but uh, we had a great time. It wasn't too difficult for the kids, so it was fun. Are you a golfer? No. <laughs> How important are libraries in your life? Very important for my daughter. We come every week for story time and borrow books and movies every week, so it is very important. Some of them are really short, some of them are funny, some of them are like really long and stuff. They're all different. And um, that's why I like it. It's kind of funny. How much do you like coming to the library? A lot. John Gulick of Library Mini Golf says a similar event at the Dartmouth Public Library was featured on ABC News. Gulick was impressed with the Bethlehem setup. Yeah, having done a lot of other libraries, this is going extremely well. It was a lot of fun. It looks like the little guys are having fun hitting the ball around. It's a good event for the library. How about the uh, setup of the course? Uh, we had some great volunteers to help us set up, and it's, it's, uh, the library's layout is wonderful for this kind of course, so it makes it fun to play. They walked around and scoped out the area and took measurements and built the course based on the measurements. So, um, no, we didn't have Tiger Woods here. <laughs> the money raised Sunday is in addition to the nearly $39,000 benefiting the library earlier this year through the Apollo Grill 10th Anniversary Week and a family open house attended by 350 people. On the scene at the Bethlehem Area Public Library, Tom Mikrantz, 2 Sports. Thank <laughs> you.